Hi, welcome to Simply Scuba, the Sunto transmitter battery kit. Now what's actually included in the battery kit is you get a new cowling, a new battery itself, and a static O-ring to replace the one that's already fitted. All you need to replace the battery of your Sunto transmitter is a small Phillips head screwdriver and your transmitter itself. When you remove the transmitter from your first stage, what you'll have is four Phillips head screws that need to be removed. Simply unscrew those and put them to one side because you're going to need them later. Sometimes they can be a little stiff, but don't push them too hard. You, uh, you don't want to strip the, uh, the head. Just take it nice and easy, apply a nice amount of pressure without twisting too hard. And then once all the four screws are out, just put them to one side, keep them nice and safe. Along two sides, of the transmitter, you have a separation between the main body, this cowling here, and the actual unit itself. You can either use a small flathead screwdriver, just be very, very gentle, because this is all quite soft plastic. You just want to pull those two sections apart, and then that comes away. Now that you can keep, or you can just throw it away, because you do get a new one in the battery kit. So just put that to one side, and this is the inside of your transmitter. Now the two parts that get changed are the green battery here and the O-ring on the inside here. If we remove the battery first, just pull that out and throw that away. Then what you have to do is you have to remove that O-ring. So what you can do is just gently stroke the O-ring and that should make it bunch up in one section and then just pull that away over all the mechanism and throw that away. The new O-ring, fit that. You don't need to lubricate this because it's a static O-ring. There's no movement in it. You just want to make sure that it's free from dust and dirt and just fit that in nice and neatly. Make sure it's nice and clean. And then with the battery, on the inside here, it tells you to put the positive towards this end, towards the tip of the, uh, of the transmitter. So on the battery, you have a little plus and you want to turn that in that direction and then simply push it into position and that's it. Then what you need to do with the new cowling, look on the inside and you'll see two lines. They need to go in line with this part of the transmitter. So you marry them up, it'll only go on one way and then just push it nice and gently until it's together and then use the four screws. If you unscrew them first, wait for it to click and then start to screw it in. That way you won't cross thread it. I like to do opposite corners and screw them in just a couple of turns and that just secures it in position and make sure that it's nice and straight. Otherwise, if you do one up completely and then start to do the others, it can just <clears throat> go in diagonally and it's not very neat. And all you want to do is you just want to do them up finger tight. You don't want to screw it in too far or too strong. Just finger tight is nice enough. Go to the opposite side, tighten that screw up. Just finger tight and start to do the others up. As soon as they're all back in, just make sure that this edge is nice and uniform, looks nice and clean, there's no debris inside that. Reconnect it to your first stage and you're ready to go diving again. 
and that is how to rechange the, um, the battery for your Sunto transmitter.